CNMI District Court Chief Judge Ramona Manglonia is not playing and found IPI in contempt for failing to comply with the 2019 court order to pay up for violating the Fair Labor Standards Act. At the time, an investigation by U.S. Department of Labor found that IPI was not paying minimum wage and overtime rates to construction contractor employees and not maintaining accurate records. As a result, Judge Manglonia ordered IPI to pay millions in back wages and penalties. By December 2020, the feds filed for IPI to be held in contempt for failing to comply with the conditions of the 2019 judgment. Additionally, USDOL barred the company from participating in the H-2B program for five years. Fast forward to this year, the Saipan Casino continues noncompliance, and as a result, Judge Manglonia is giving Chinese billionaire and IPI chairperson and executive director Su Li Chia until 1.30 tomorrow to pay $1.1 million in back wages under the 2019 consent judgment. $800,000 must be deposited into an escrow account to secure future payment of wages of IPI employees going forward. And for IPI to pay back wages to former workers employed after the 2019 judgment was entered. If the company fails to make payment, the company will go into receivership. Attorney Joyce Tang with the Civil and Tang Law Firm has been named as the federal equity receiver. She will have the power to possess and liquidate the company's assets. Attorney Tang will receive a compensation of $350 per hour from the defendants. The contempt order isn't the Saipan Casino's only debt. Court documents state a notice of tax lien by the CNMI Department of Defense indicates the company owes about $10 million in taxes.